Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, this is a third video. This is uh, day two of the Agent O testing, and uh, today was leg day. So I posted my leg workout with the weights uh, with this post, obviously. And uh, uh, you know, I did. I guess you could say it's decently high volume today, and I did pretty good weights um, in comparison to what I did last week. Uh, I took my Agent O around 310-ish this afternoon, and I actually took it with my green magnitude, so I used about 10 ounces of water, and to anybody that wants to maybe mix powders, I just want to let you know that the Agent O overpowers uh, whatever else you're going to use in it, to be honest with you. If it's just like a one scoop serving, like if you're going to be using it, like say with like a jacked or something, or a green magnitude, it's... You know, it's got a little bit of a tart, uh, citrusy uh, kind of a taste, but it's it's not bad. But I do recommend doing the four ounces in the shot. It actually tastes a little bit better that way. Um, let's see what else. Uh, I felt it about ten minutes after I took it again, like I did yesterday. However, today I didn't have much of a elevation in body temperature or as much of a uh, increased uh, heart rate. But it was a, a slight increase in both, but just not like yesterday. My body tends to get uh, used to any kind of a you know supplement, or if I go to the doctor for something, he gives me some kind of drug. My body tends to you know acclimate itself to it pretty quickly, so I was pretty much expecting that. But uh, throughout my workout, I was able to keep a, a decent amount of weight on myself. As you guys can tell, I went up to like 405 on my squats. And I would have done working sets there, but since I was doing a strip set, I think I only did like one set or something like that at 405. And on my leg presses, I went up to, I believe, 715. And, you know, had I not uh, wanted to do some front squats after that, I probably would have upped it to, you know, in the eight or 900s, uh, you know, for actual working sets because I actually started doing uh, more rest pause. So when you do that, it kind of ups the intensity, so I didn't want to go as heavy. But I felt pretty good. I had really good energy up until about the end of my workout whenever I was working on my leg curls and my uh, stiff-legged deads. That's generally, uh, I generally hit the wall a little bit before that. So, you know, Agent O actually helped prolong a little bit of my strength today, but I did still kind of hit the wall, but that can be expected. It's, you know, it's legs. It's a big body uh, body group, and uh, you know it's you know you're gonna hit that wall if you train your legs the way you need to. But you know my focus was there, my energy was you know I would say probably you know an eight out of ten. It was a pretty good day. Uh, my strength, I wasn't stronger than I normally am. I wouldn't say because of the product. I was stronger because I didn't do deadlifts yesterday on my back because I'm switching it to my shoulder day. That way my lower back isn't fatigued for when I do squats. So I think that was the reason why my strength kind of stayed with me for a little bit. But, you know, other than that, uh, you know, everything was good. And I really enjoyed, you know, using the product today for my leg session. I got a lot of good reps out and I felt a really good pump in my quads and my hams. And actually a, a kind of a pump in my glutes as well, which is kind of weird. So, you know, everything felt good, and I can't wait. You know, tomorrow is going to be shoulders, traps, and like I said, deadlifts, and probably a little bit of ab work. And, you know, you guys are going to see that video, and I'll let you guys know how that went. And if you guys have any other questions, just feel free to ask. Uh, send me an email, private message, wherever you got to do. And until then, take care, and uh, keep training hard, guys. All right?